The Urketeer has arrived once again in Warframe. And we will go through Do everything that he has brought. Who knows? Right off you the may bat, turn into a we can see a great someday. Prime Mod, Prime Reach. Which is going to be plus three range for melee. This is pretty good for most melee weapons, especially whips, uh, everything like that. Uh, this is one people have asked for before. Um, it would have been better if it was a Warframe one. Uh, but it's not, sadly, but it is for the melee. So it is a decent Prime Mod. Go over here, Prime Expel Infested. A lot of people like these uh, Prime Expel or Cleanse things. This is going to be a pretty good one. People are probably going to want to buy this as well. And then we have Prime Cleanse Corpus for Shotgun. I believe we had this one recently. Uh, so this isn't really much of a, you know, a new one that we haven't seen before. Or one that we haven't seen in a while. So there's that. Uh, we have some decorations right off the bat. We have the Statue of Barricadeer. We have some little wings for the Sentinel. We have Prisma Dual Cleavers if you're interested in those. Uh, another thing, Fireworks to your fireworks we have another mod this is not a prime mod but this is just a rare mod mark of the beast plus 120 percent status and critical chance for second weapons for 24 seconds on melee kills within six seconds or six melee kills within six seconds so there's that there's a new color palette they show right here eminence so if you want to get this this looks like it's just blue and purple and yeah just really shades of blue and purple uh, pink you see a little bit of white right there so if you're interested in those colors, if you don't already have them, uh, you can get that as well. There's an Axie V8 relic, which is just going to be some Volt. Uh, Volt and Lex, it looks like, but mostly Volt. The, he did just have a Neo one of this, I believe. So it seems like there's a Volt, and if you use that opportunity to get all the Volt relics, then you're going to have a fun time with this one. It's going to um, really pay out. Either you're going to sell this relic or you sell the parts that you get from this. Or if you really want Volt, which a lot of people want Volt Prime, uh, you can get Volt yourself and then or sell it if you get lucky enough if you had the other relics that he offered with his other visits. Then you have a Lotus one here. This one's pretty neat. Uh, last time we had a Barracketeer one. I kind of like this one. It's pretty neat. Uh, we have the Prisma Kubro Glyph. A lot of people have used this from what I've seen. There is a Cyandana right here. Oh, this is a clack of sign done, this is the one I had on my old account. So this is very, very decent. It goes well with a lot of frames. It's not, you know, the most stylish, but you can definitely work your ways around it. There's an armor set. This is really just going to brighten another color that you want. Obviously, I believe this is going to be the energy color, I believe, if I remember correctly. Or this is just going to be your primary color. Either way, you're going to be able to mess with this and really show out the color that you're trying to do. And it looks like there's a piece for the Tenno as well. Uh, it, it's decent, it's kind of neat. I don't really like it. It just looks like a straight horn coming out. It's like you got stabbed from behind. I'm not a huge fan of it, but if you like this type of design, go for it. And we have a pistol skin here. Obviously the Sand of Inara's quest, like always. There's this new art right here interested in that type of stuff I what I, I don't I don't even know what this is so this is from the can be a drift but I don't know if this re resembles I guess a worm I don't know what I don't remember anything in the can be a drift that looks like this but if you're interested in it <laughs> just I guess take it for yourself I, I'm so confused in that one uh, overall this is a, it's better than the last time. Last time there was absolutely nothing. Uh, this one at least you have Viper Wraith. I mean, I I'm sure if you if you get this and you can get a Viper mod from one of the Syndicate areas, I believe it's gonna be. Uh, I think it's Cephalon Suda who has a Viper one. If not, it's Arbiters of Hexes. So that may work on that. And then you have a new uh, Prime or not Prime Prisma weapon. So you can always get these weapons and upgrade them and then put your mastery rank higher. So that's going to be good if you want to get that type of stuff. Uh, but overall, I think the best thing that you're going to get from this is the Axie V8 relics. Put cleavers and wraith just to upgrade them. Uh, that's all. You don't really, I'm sure you're not going to want to use them. They don't seem the best. I mean 19% critical chance is not the greatest with no status chance either. Well, the cleavers are pretty decent. I might actually get those and try to upgrade them because they don't seem like they'll be that hard to upgrade. But 
really besides that there's not great mods I mean prime reach is the best one you're probably gonna get out of this if that's, if that's what you think I mean cleanse corpus I don't really necessarily like those mods I mean because what there's three four now fractions uh, since that one was added from the new war if you count that one really um I mean unless you want to make a mod slot for a specific one but then again you're gonna have to remember to click on that one every single time if you're going to a corpus infested planet or you're going to an infested planet or if you're going to you know anything else whatever, the other one so there's that I mean there's not again this isn't the greatest V8 relic is obviously gonna be your the best one you may want to buy a ton of those save them up you can either use them or just go out and try to sell them and see if people are asking for it in the trade chat but overall if you want to be stylish I guess this is the time to do it and purchase the things that he has uh, brought and go from there all right well I hope you enjoyed this video uh, none, another short and sweet barrel visit video I try to do these every single time he comes and if you haven't seen a few of them I will they will be in the Warframe playlist that will be to the right along with all the other Warframe videos I've made on this channel to the left will be the most recent video I've done on this channel in the middle of the subscribe button uh, just like I said in the last video I saw a huge uh, increase at least from what I'm used to in subscribers over just the past few days um, I really appreciate it I, I love seeing that stuff so I appreciate the support uh, thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed